Hey folks, COD Mobile's first ever Mythic Operator is here in the form of Spectre T3. Now I don't exactly know how much it's going to cost to max out this character, but if it's in the same ballpark as a Mythic weapon, then I kind of feel iffy about that, just because I personally would pay more for a gun skin than a character skin. That being said, let's get to spinning and see if we can get it early on. What you're seeing here is the base form of Spectre. There's an advanced form that you can only unlock after you, I think, achieve seven out of the nine possible upgrades. Now, the base skin is, it's fine, but it's not exactly worth the price of a lucky draw. But if you want to get the advanced form, then you probably have to pay a minimum of 30, if not 40,000 CP, which again, in my personal opinion, is not worth it. I was actually almost not going to get this draw at all, but, oh, oh wow, there's a four or five draws in and we get the legendary M16. That's awesome. See, I'm almost tempted to call it a day here, but no, we're gonna, we're gonna go all the way. As I was saying, it's not exactly worth it to pay 15,000 CP for just the base character skin, but it's also not really worth paying 40,000 CP for the advanced form. So, you know, if you really like the Spectre skin, by all means go for it, but if not, I'd say save up for the Mythic Holger Redux, or next season we're going to get a Mythic EM2, which is going to be space-themed. That could be quite cool as well. Alright, next up we have the Kali Sticks. Wingsuit, nothing too special. Honestly, if I was not trying to make content out of it, I would have been so happy getting that M16 in just four or five draws. But nope, now we have to go all the way. Let's see how much the last spin costs. 6,700 CP, oh God. Oh, I, I am in pain right now. There he is, Mythic Spectre T3. I'm already in too deep, so I'm going to max him out. I'll see you guys 20,000 CP later. I don't, I don't even know. Anywho, I'm gonna go upgrade and we're gonna take a look at all the features. All right, so I unlocked every single upgrade. Right here, we're looking at the base form and after seven out of the nine upgrades, we get the advanced form which in my personal opinion is a massive improvement. We also get uh, a slightly modified arm skin here, barely noticeable. Okay, this is the coolest part about upgrading this character is you, you get these color palettes. In the end, I think you get, yeah, you get 24. You get 24 different color combinations. And this here is my favorite. I like the iridescent for zone A and also this golden one for zone B. Looks pretty nice. We also get a Shadow Blade skin, which in Battle Royale would be Quick Strikes, the class. I really don't like that class, by the way. I think it's pretty much just a complete waste. Uh, we also get a character emote here, which is pretty cool. But if you're gonna stop at seven upgrades out of the nine, um, I would say that this is the one you should skip out on. Okay, we also get a slightly different loot box, which is pretty cool. Finally, we have the multiplayer victory screen stance. and the Battle Royale one as well. The BR one is pretty cool because the drop stance is cool and also the uh, dropping animation is 
pretty sweet. All right, so that's all the features you get from upgrading the Mythic. Now we're gonna take a look at the other items in the training room. Right here is the legendary M16 with the Ether Camel equipped. It fits pretty well in this blueprint. We do have a custom iron sight. It's not really that spectacular, but it's still much, much better than the default M16 iron sight. The kill effect is pretty sweet as well. All right, here are the Kali sticks. Nothing special. And last but not least, we have the new emote on Mythic Spectre. Pretty awesome. All right, so in today's video, we're gonna take the Mythic Spectre for a spin in Battle Royale. Uh, next Tuesday, there's gonna be a video of Mythic Spectre in multiplayer, so stay tuned for that one as well. Now, without further ado, enjoy the gameplay. Have a great one, y'all.
します。